Hello everyone. This is a bit of a weird time to start a recording. I'm actually still on a work day. It's not at night. It's about four in the afternoon. But I decided, you know, I want something to look forward to when I come back to this game. I want this thing dead. So I'm just gonna come and kill this thing. I still want to record it though, because I feel like that's part of the blind let's play. To actually finish and kill this thing. Anywho, I'm trying with a different strategy this time. Decided so to switch Kanji out for uh, my good mate Yukiko. Hopefully, that fixes the problem. Because, see, Yukiko is not weak to wind. And that's, like, the big initial problem with this part. It really fucking sucks to die to the initial wind part. Lose so many lives, and it's, it's just no good. Plus, she can cure fear, I believe. So that's just going to be insanely useful. So this is basically the all-magic party. Only problem, really, with this setup right now is that Yukiko has really shitty defense because her uh, armor is garbage. I cannot switch with Chie's armor, unfortunately, because you need to have another armor. You can't equip no armor, I don't believe. So, I mean, she's just going to have to tank hits, and that's going to suck. But luckily, she might not take all the hits, and also there's the fact that we have two healers now. So life should be a little bit easier. Plus, she's going to hit harder than Kanji and more reliably. Because her magic is insane. I even gave her a charm to increase her magic by three. Just to, like, extra go in hard in the paint. So let's let's just beat an ass. Everyone's SP is really high right now. I hope this works out because I used a lot of SP items at the start of this. I still have plenty more, but it would really suck to get through all this and, you know, still not be able to do it. But I'm going gonna, gonna to try my best been a little bit so I might forget totally how this works but I think I get the major idea I fought the thing three times got pretty close the second time decently close the third time let's just hit him where it hurts <coughs> that's pretty good now this this should hit hard I believe this yeah, yeah, yeah. me Patra does the whole party too so as long as she's not the one that gets feared into not being able to move plus I only cost six SP so, in theory, she should be able to save some lives. And, you know, I, I shit on it. But she has the ability to heal people from... I forgot I got rid of that. <laughs> God fucking damn it, Ross. Oh, why? Yeah, that's pretty good. Which means these three are able to do good damage. Yeah, look at that. Now, I just hope that Yukiko doesn't get destroyed. And all will be bright in the world. Eh, that wasn't too bad. Plus, that's, like, really the only attack that's going to do, like, physical damage. Baby can also do the one cube attack, but that doesn't even do that much damage. It's mostly the magic shit. And I think armor does affect that. But then there's also the fact that she has just... High magic, so it makes sense that she'd be good against magic. I don't know. That logic really applies here, but I hope it does. Honestly, the big reason she's here, other than damage, is the fact that she heals better than Teddy does. So she can do something like this. And even though it's like the weaker healing spell, it heals just about as good. So now I have two healers. Hopefully that'll keep our health good to go. Won't just be Teddy using all of his SP on this. Can you like hit me with that a little bit? No, I'm just gonna go for you to go again. Ow. That does do a lot of damage. And I think he gets stronger too. So I need to be extra careful. Wow. We are destroying this guy's health. Uh, do we want to knock it down yet? Yeah, sure, why not? Part of me almost wanted to put Chie in the party, so that I could do the, uh, chance of the extra attack with Chie and you could go. But it doesn't seem like anyone wants to help us with this all attack nonsense, so it doesn't really matter that much. Like, I, I, I never see fucking Rise stepping in. Like, here you go! No, she just doesn't care. Now comes the nonsense. Luckily, we won't have to guard. 
All right, there goes my ability to evade. Red wall. Oh, you're actually starting with fire. Interesting. How's that going to affect things? Um, Teddy resists thunder. Or, I mean, he is weak to thunder. I actually resist fire with Yukiko, so that's fine. What about me, personally? I'm not weak to fire. No. I do usually switch to Yadagarasu at around this time. Kind of wish you did do win, because I'm strong to that. But I guess that works. I could switch to something that actually is resistant to fire. I could drain fire with that guy. And that also lets me decrease their attack. I mean, that's a good start. I guess I'll do that. It's weird that you start with fire, though. I thought he always started with wind. I mean, I'm fine with it. It does mean that Yukiko can't actually do good damage anymore, so she's pretty much just gonna have to be on heal duty for the time being. Let's go for the dark insta-kill. I'm sure that'll work. Watch it just be like some secret that you can just dark insta-kill the boss, and this is like the only boss in the whole game you can do that to. Alright, yeah, you're just gonna be healing. Anytime you... You're like, I'm never gonna waste her turn attacking. Even if it's just a little bit of health, you can heal that a little bit. Right, here comes the fire. Get drained, idiot. <laughs> Alright, well this is going generally pretty good. Now we can switch back to Yadagarasu, or for the first time the Yada, so I can null fear. And we can also increase our hit and evade rate. That's another thing we could do. Although he's probably just going to get rid of that. I mean, it would waste his turn if he got rid of that. Eh, sure, why not? He seems to do slightly different stuff each time, but it's not always the same what he does. Let's just keep hitting him hard where it hurts. Hey, took a little bit of damage from that, so I can heal that up. Lowering his attack seems to work really well. He can't actually get rid of that. For the most part, he just gets rid of your buffs, which is fine. The only thing he really debuffs on you is fear, which is really annoying. <laughs> wow. Oof. What happened, bud? Um, don't, don't shit on him just yet. Poke. Yeah. For the most part, it's just going to be Yosuke and uh, Teddy doing 95% of the work with their attacks. I'm actually here more for support than anything else. I mean, I can't die. I'm like always the last person to die unless I get fear killed. Because my defense is just so good. But it's still very annoying. There you go. Alright. Barber system's reverted, and he's gonna bring the thing back. So it's at this point that we can basically start attacking him with a little bit more abandon. Because he's gonna bring the shell back, and I think he's gonna start his fear strats. Which, again, very annoying, but not much we can really do about that. But this is why we have Yadagarasu out. In fact, I could almost, like, keep out whatever I have until he starts fear strats. God, I feel like I'm talking about the Pokemon metagame. Anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna heal that. Just in case. His magic attacks are going to stop now. But it's always good to have a little bit of extra health. Alright, now we hope that Yukiko is good. He's gonna use that shit where he's like... Yeah, stagnant air, and then he's gonna try and fear assault. Now the question is... Is Yukiko gonna get hit with that? Alright, well we haven't got hit with it yet. Because he's, he's still chanting. Then he's gonna use prayer and he's gonna bring the head back. Well, whatever. His attack is still... It actually got reverted, but that's fine. I still want to stick with Yada, because I don't want to get feared. Me getting fear killed is just no fun. We do get the one freebie off of a fear kill. I'm not sure what from. There's some item in my inventory, or like maybe one of the character's possessions that just prevents fear kill. Maybe it's the social link, I have no idea. Definitely wasn't uh, Kanji in that case, because I have, like, his first social link, and that's it. I'm actually going to attack with you this turn. Just get that little extra stab of damage. Our health is good enough. 
All right, you can code, just don't get feared, or if you do get feared, please move. That's all I ask. All right, you dodged. Good shit. All right, not too bad. Don't worry, we got him. Now we are going to... No, I could be using Agulo. Would that do more damage? Let's find out. Eh, a little bit more damage. That's fine. Stress don't work on me anymore. I got Yukiko on the party. Yeah, I think you could go with the secret to this fight, honestly. Just having the ability to cure fear. Fear is so obnoxious. Still can't cure the enervation, and that was a miss. And cool. That was a good crit. Anytime he crits, he just does that bullshit, which is really annoying. Oy, not much you can really do about that. We've gotten him to, like, nearly half health, which is insane for the first round. Alright, so we're going to actually have to bring Teddy back. There's really no other way around that. Teddy's going to be the one that heals everybody. Well, we got most of our stuff back. Alright, Teddy, come on back. It's really just going to depend on what Yosuke... Yeah, Yosuke's not doing anything. That's fine. He's totally useless like this! It's only when Kanji's scared or enervated. I forget which one it is. Then we're gonna heal. This should get everyone's health back up to a decent enough level. A little worried about Yukiko, but we'll see what happens. God fucking damn it, this guy. Whatever. I brought the full head back, so it really doesn't matter as much anymore. However, it does mean that he gets the ability to use spells and bombs, which fucking... Yeah, yeah, here we go. Thanks. That does so much damage. Alright, it's time to switch back to the Persona and actually lower that attack. That'd be great. Not sure if that lowers this guy's attack, but I'm going to do it anyway. Yosuke, do something... Son of a bitch. Well, we're going to have to spend this turn curing the fear at any point. So unless he hard targets, he won't be able to kill one of us. I mean, he, he usually doesn't use too many spells this early in the fight. Not that I consider this that early, but still. We're, we're pretty deep in it. Yeah. Yeah. You go for me, please. That'd be excellent. Excellente. Alright, so we did lower his attack, which means we could switch back to Yada and actually increase our evasion. Yeah, why am I even, like, bothering to really attack with my character? I really should just be on this duty. Increasing our abilities and letting everyone else just do the work. I also need to lower his defense, I guess. Yeah. Eh, maybe not. Now, you are actually going to heal. You have a lot more SP at this point, so yeah, you should focus on healing. I am good. And Teddy can hit him with a good old buffalo. Oof, a lot. Whatever. Son of a bitch. Teddy, how can you keep missing now? I even gave you a hit buff. And here comes the bomb. Good. Um, can you cure that, Yukiko? Now, if you could cure that, that'd be the spicy. Whoops, Teddy's gone boneless. I think I can cure that, actually. Only on one ally. I mean, hey, that works. Thanks a bunch. That's all we needed it on, so I, I guess that's fine. Here goes. Would have liked to increase my uh, attack this turn, or to lower his defense, I mean. I'm good. Yosuke keys a little bit healing, and Teddy. Alright. Yeah, this is not going too bad. Only had one death so far, and that was because of a bullshit crit. Piss off. 
Goodness. You don't hit her with a bomb. Well, it looks like you're just on pure enter bait duty. So much for lowering the defense. I mean, I'll, I'll do this as slow as it takes. We, we do have a technical time limit because we have the SP to worry about. Also, it just gets harder and harder the further you get along in the fight. He starts doing more and more bullshit. But right now, he's mostly on bomb duty. When you get really late in the fight, he's just like, Thunderspell constantly. And it gets really fucking annoying. And the attack reverted. Cool. Dodge. You're best. You're the bait. You're the very best. Yosuke. Why? You know what? Fuck it. I'm, I'm gonna switch back to Bomb Jack. I don't care. I'm gonna lower your attack again. That's okay. You can deal with it. That does, like, waste so much SP, though. Um, you can't cure that. I don't know why I thought you could. So instead, you're just going to Gorilla. And you're going to have to suck up however much SP you lose. Yeah, it's a lot. Hey, can you cure that? I know Teddy can. No, you just cure Fear. Which I guess is fine. That was everyone's health. I think we're going to use a little bit. Let's just take it slow. We have enough SP for right now. Alright, Teddy. Uh, it sucks to have to use Energy Shower on one person. Because it costs so much SP for it, but oh well. That's fine. Cool. I'll take that. Now, let's beat your ass. Could switch to Ose to do... Can I lower defense with someone else? Uh, who lowers defense? Uh, it's... Mara Kunda? Mm. We can increase our own defense, which would be pretty good. I also don't know if there's someone who can, like, lower defense without, you know, using the... Oh, you had me, Patra, too. Hmm. It's good to know. So I have another option in case shit hits the fan. But if I do that, I have to switch off Crow, and I don't really want to do that. You know, it's nice having Cool Breeze. That actually doesn't help much in this circumstance. It'll help eventually. Alright, well, I'm just gonna have to switch to Osei then. Only guy who can lower defense, even though he does it for fucking 24 SP. Oh well. Let's get this ro this 8-bit uh, dude down. It's kind of bothering me, sitting in this form for too long. There you go. Let's get to this other form already. We're actually hitting harder than our... Uh, items. I thought those were going to be key, but actually, we might not even need them. Uh, and here comes the spell again. Teddy, are you okay? Someone heal him. Yeah, I got it, I got it. Alright, I think I know what I'm going to do. So I'm actually going to switch to Yada. I'm gonna cure Teddy. Yosuke is going to, in one hit, knock this guy out of health, right? Cool. And now we're gonna heal. So nice we do get this one free hit, even though it's not for much. Um, we could actually do Teddy healing and not worry. Yeah, Teddy healing sounds good. Teddy does technically heal more. Oh, man. Lame. He does have some good evasion, that baby. Give him that. Alright, what you gonna do, baby? That's fine. And blue wall. Oh, no. Elect resist. 
Okay, in that case, we're gonna have to worry about two of our party members, right? Because I think Yosuke and Teddy are both weak to Thunder. I know for a fact Teddy is. I'm pretty sure about Yosuke, too. Shit. Well, we're not going to be able to do much this time around. If he is using Thunder, though... What can I do about that? I guess I could switch to somebody until he starts using the bullshit. So I can Null Thunder with this person. I can also Null Thunder with that person, Null Thunder with that. Can I add, like, Blue Wall to somebody? I wish. No. I mean, this guy's gonna have to do. I could just go for... Um, uh, Ice or Wind, that works. Something to do for the meanwhile. Yeah, it's just the Wind. Alright. Alright, you guys are gonna have to guard. There's really no other way around it. I don't need those extra attacks coming in. Uh, no, 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 thanks. Looks like me and Yukiko are gonna have to do the majority of the work. He won't do two moves in a row, so we only have to guard the first hit. And he's just gonna whisper. That's fine. Are you gonna actually use the thunder, or are you just gonna double build? You're gonna double build. Okay. Well, that's kind of annoying. I wish I knew you were going to do that. Teddy's health kind of bothers me a little bit, but not enough. Plus, we're going to be guarding one of those turns, so I think Teddy's going to be fun. Are you going for fear already? Yeah, you're just skipping over. Shit. Okay, that's a problem. Well, I can cure that, so I'm going to do that. It was Lamia that could do it? No, it wasn't Lamia. It was, uh, Gorgon. Alright. I don't know how Gorgon stands up the electricity, but he's not apparently using it, so I don't really care. I might just start attacking then. I mean, if you're just gonna waste your turns, I'm not gonna sit here like a dumbass. Watch him now, just start using it. Like, hey, fuck you! <laughs> I mean, he's already on evil small tactics, so I don't know. Maybe he just switched up his strat. Maybe I should heal anyway, just in case. And uh, nope. Hit him as much as we can. Gotta take some risks. It'll smile. Ooh, that's a good one. Uh, you know, I'm still fine with those results. Because we can hear that. You know, if I switch to Yadagarasu, does that actually nullify the fear? Let's find out. Nope! That's not how that works. Alright. Well, in that case... I actually could have cured all the fear with this person, but... Yeah, I might have been able to give Yosuke a turn. I don't know if he actually be able to move or not. I think I'm actually going to use a Snuff Soul with my turn. No, Yosuke's going to be able to move too. Cool. Alright. Yukiko's got us covered. Yeah, Yukiko was really the fucking secret to this fight. <laughs> Just not bringing in Kanji. Kanji wasn't doing anything. Unfortunately. Yeah, fuck you, dude. I need proof. I exist. And that's why I'm gonna become this fucking thing. Like a Zoink Scoob. That hurts. Gonna use the spell. No. Just gonna use the bomb. God damn it. Alright, this Tay is definitely a turn to heal. Sorry. Nah, that's all cool. Now we just need to start bringing this thing down again. Let's just keep using this one. 
gonna heal with you. I am thou. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh yeah. In this case, SP is getting a little shaky, but he's mostly just using it for wind. In fact, exclusively using it for wind. So that's fine. Thunder? No yeah, thunder. More bombs. Oh man. I want to do other things with my turn other than cure innervation. I mean, it only costs three, so of course I'm going to use it. I'm not dealing with a huge loss of SP unless I have to. Unless there's better things I could be doing with my turn. Technically, there aren't. Really, just for me. And actually, no, a couple people need healing. All right. Teddy. Just keep hitting with Buffalo. Buffalo, whatever. That's fine. It's arguably the best thing you could do is fight Ross. That's not too bad. At least it doesn't give us status effects. And Yosuke even dodged. What a cool dude. Alright, now, in that case, I can start lowering your defense. That's that's more useful than anything else right now, honestly. Lowering that defense is pretty critical. <clears throat> I think I'm actually going to heal with Teddy this turn. Use more Teddy healing. Which means you can go... Can use her own attack. And that means we can heal. Yeah, he does heal more, honestly. But costs so much more. Actually, it only costs five more. They're interchangeable. That was a nice turn. Well, wow. he's just being awfully nice this turn. Which means that gives me another turn to do something. I might even Tempest Slash. Feeling extra spicy, why not? We lowered his defense, let's go for it. Oh, nice crit. Didn't really matter, because you can't actually do anything with crits in this fight. Alright, we're gonna Medi... No, this feels like another Teddy heal turn, so I'm gonna aggro. Please don't actually knock him out. Alright, perfect. Do not want to start his attack sessions until we're ready. This is going much smoother. Having you you can kill in the party fixes everything about this fight. Is he just going to one round Teddy? Oh yeah, yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah, indeed, someone heal him. All right, that's that's all you. All right, Garula, and we'll knock that down. All right. Oh, with that flail fist, Teddy. All right, now we're gonna hit him with Agulo, and then we're gonna heal with Teddy. Everyone has enough SP to do what they need to do, so I'm not worried right now. Baby can't do that much damage. That's the that's the major thing, unless he uses spells, of course. And you're not using any spells; you're just attacking, dumbass. Wait, wall. What is that? Is that ice? Oh, that's ice. Well, it looks like Yukiko is finally not going to be able to do anything. That's kind of sad. All right. Oh shoot! You're weak to oh, damn it! I had a feeling. Who resists ice? You are null to ice, and you can also cure. Ooh. Okay. Well, then you'll do just fine. Your magic's not terrible. And what spell? Wait. Do you use? Ice, yeah, you do use ice. All right, we're just gonna have to fucking attack with you. Actually, wait. No, this now is the perfect time to start using those items. Yeah, we have wind and fire, and thunder. Ooh, we have three. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, fuck you. Um, Teddy actually resists ice, so that's gonna work extra good. However, Yukiko, I don't know what to do with you. 
All right, now is when we're gonna want to start using some of those other SP healing items, like a Snuff Soul. We're gonna use that on Teddy just to make sure that he's able to heal. Great. Yusuke is not totally imperative right now. You're gonna guard. Fortunately, your attack option has been robbed, so you are also going to use one of these items. Cool. Here comes the ice. Nice. Hey, you really didn't need to dodge that, but thanks anyway. <coughs> not, not complaining. I promise. Alright, we're looking pretty spicy here. Me and Yosuke are going to have to be the ones who deal damage for these couple of turns. Kyo's going to have to guard, and Teddy's going to have to focus on healing. Actually, we could probably attack this turn and get away with it. Oh my god, that's so bad. <laughs> Never mind, we're just going to focus on healing with Teddy. Are you kidding me? That was awful. Teddy, what was that? 26? I didn't realize your attack was that bad. <laughs> At least do, like, what I can do. Oh no, I guess his defense is just really fucking good. Never mind. Sorry, Teddy. Alright, we're looking pretty good. I don't know about you, but I think we're looking pretty fucking good. Also, this is the last turn he's going to be able to use ice. So, or the last turn he's going to want to use ice anyway. Potentially. And we're getting the creepy smiles all up in here. Cool. I just single targeted. Cool. I mean, there's a higher chance if you single target, so I'm just gonna cure that. Thanks. Yeah, that thing would cure my fear. I could believe that. Also, you're not bringing back the fucking robot <coughs> thing, whatever the hell it is. Who knew all it took was getting rid of Kanji? Ow, oh, son of a bitch. You can touch a single target. Bullshit. That's perfectly fine, actually. He must be really thinking, he was like, ah, I'm gonna... He, he could have feared both me and Yukiko, and that would have been kind of smart. But, no. Alright, that health is looking pretty low, bud. I don't know about you. But, uh, I think we're done here. Unless we miss with both of these two. There we go! Boink! It's time to get wild! Fire that! Piled the baby. That's game. That felt pretty fucking good. Now that's the run I wanted to get. Only two deaths, both of them were Teddy. You could go fix the shit out of that. And of course we get Treasure Radar. But for once, it's not something we get after the battle that could have helped us. The Treasure Radar objectively could not have helped us in this case. But thanks anyway. How are you feeling, dumbass? Finally awake, huh? You've been a major pain in our ass. You don't even know, Yosuke. There were two, three of you in a previous dimension. Anyway. What the? You guys. Who the hell are you guys? We're the Ninja Turk. Came to talk to you. Talk <coughs> to me? Wow, no one's ever wanted to talk to me. The police are after you. They think you're the one who killed King Moron and the other two. So, are you the killer? All the cases, all on me. No, he probably just killed King Moron. <laughs> That's right. I did it. No, he's, he's just accepting the blame. You piece of shit. There's no way. He, he just wants people to look at and him. And not just that bastard Moraoka. That stupid announcer. And the Konishi bitch, too. Nope, 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 nope. It's just, it's just Moroka, if I anyone. I killed all of them. It was all me. Where'd it go? 
What's going on? <laughs> it's gone. That freaking monster disappeared. Boy, we beat it so hard we actually killed the shadow. Son of a bitch. Yeah, <laughs> son of a bitch. Yeah. Hey. He's exhausted. We need to hurry and get him out of here. No, let's let's drag him along the way. Teddy, you can like back trail him so he skids across all the stone eight bit flooring. Where am I? You're in your maker, bitch. That's Junes. Why am I here? What the hell are you guys? Where the nit stop it? Why did the TV? Yeah. Hey. You seem confused from everything that happened, but we have a bunch of questions for you. I have a question for you, Teddy. Why are you still in the fucking suit? You can you can walk around like a normal human being, you know. Why did you do all this? Answer in ten words or less. I mean, I guess he just enjoys the suit. <laughs> what the hell? Four. Is that a costume? All right, that's eight. All right, you answer it, I guess. What a loser. One, two, three, four. Get out of my face. Oh, that's freak. perfectly ten. F freak! <clears throat> Hold it, Teddy. You're not helping. All right, that was six, Yosuke. Yeah, that's fine. Did you really do it? I don't. I don't think you actually Get did. Get off my back! I already told you. I did it. I refuse to believe Why? that. Why? How could you do such a thing? Three people are dead because of you. I don't buy it. I don't buy it for a second. He just wants attention. Also, his eyes look like mouths, like black gaping mouths. Everyone's talking about it, right? It's a huge deal. And I did it. All of it. All by myself. There's no way you did it all by yourself. If you did do it, someone helped you. You just wanted the attention? Then why did you target me and the others? How did you kidnap us? <sighs> Are you whacking in the store? Oh, look who it is. <laughs> hey, Yuki. Yeah, he, she was integral to kicking your ass. After I hope you understand this that. Time, now you want to talk to me? <laughs> nah. What bullshit. Answer me. If you held a grudge against me, that's fine. But why the others? <laughs> what a joke. You're so desperate, it hurts. Alright, that's it. Let's throw him back in the TV. Fuck him. I didn't care who I attacked. Everyone pisses me off. Yeah, I guess it is kind of hard to get a gun in there. Okay, that's a fucked up joke. But You what? You gotta be kidding me. You killed Senpai over nothing? You son of a bitch! I hope you're ready to get what's coming to you. Yeah, boot to the face. <laughs> what? You gonna kill me? No, you stupid. What, you want us to get arrested too? Kanji kun! We're not gonna arrest over your punk ass. Kill you? It ain't gonna be what's that up? easy, you piece of shit. What you did All can right. never be taken back. Mmm. No. You're gonna own up to your crimes and pay for what you did. You ain't gonna be allowed to kick the bucket until you understand exactly what it is you've done. There's Kanji. <laughs> why, damn it? Why does she have to die because of this bastard? I don't know. Why does anyone have to die because of bastards? <laughs> Dude, the cops. Huh? What are you waiting for? Call the damn police! Yeah, you're right. Yosuke. Just a just a one single siren noise in the background with a black game over, yeah. Game over, alright. At least Adachi san seemed happy. Yeah, because he's the real murderer. He's gonna come through. Watch. I guess this means our work is done. Yeah. Eh. He did it all to draw attention. Wow. I can't get my head around that. Just wrong. I mean, not that it would have been okay if he'd had a better reason. I know. Don't worry. I mean, what if he had like a really cool reason? Like, I need to kill all 13 of the Titans to bring back my wife. No. 
It's finally over. Let's leave 16. the rest Weren't there the 16 tight uh, guardians? I don't remember. My <coughs> world will be peaceful again now. Hooray. I'm I'm, I'm actually kind of glad cuz I'm kind of fucking tired of staring at your eyes. Yeah. I'm happy for you. We really went through a lot. I like scoring with guys. <coughs> oh, come on. Will you ever let it go? Before you can what? go. Scoring with guys? Kanji. Yes. Y you don't need to know the details. Yeah, I missed that. Anyway. I'm sure you'd like us to forget the sauna incident too, right, Kanji Kun? Uh, uh well, not, not a little bit, I mean. That's not fair. I look pretty good in this video. Everyone else's too. Don't worry, it was That's kind of right. a shit show. We three are the only <coughs> ones who saw everyone's secret. I'm the only one who saw literally everyone's see Oh no, I guess it was me, Yosuke, and Chie. Hey, so what was Yosuke's like? Come on, it's about time you told us. It was really boring and actually kind of dreadful. It wasn't that interesting. It was embarrassing. <laughs> pretty much like pretty much like the rest. <clears throat> Come on, let's leave it at that. Speaking of which, nothing really happened in your case, huh? Yeah, I was just too. No, what? My my show is going to be the final fucking boss. Just wait. Really? Wait, really? Is there something special about Senpai after all? I mean, I can have like eighteen different personas at once, so probably. Sensei is the man. Yeah, Sensei literally don't give no fucks. And now that the case is solved, we won't be calling you leader anymore, will we? I don't think you called me leader that much anyway. Oh yeah, it's kind of sad. You can keep calling me leader if you want. That's interesting, bro. Anyway. Hey, why don't we have a celebration? Oh no, those go so well in P5. We always have a rap party after we're done shooting. It's fun and it'll help give us some closure. Ooh, a party! That sounds great. Let's go all out. Beach party, beach party, oh, beach oh, party. I want to go to Yuki-chan's house. Does she have a beach there? No. How soon could you get a beach built there? Springs, table tennis, yukata, geisha, Fujiyama, full witness. Teddy, where'd you learn all these things? You're but I agree. Right. <clears throat> Yukiko Senpai's family runs a hot springs in. Oh no, not this fucking plot line again. Hot spring that Yukiko Senpai bathes in too? Alright, Kanji. Can, can we just all stop shitting on her while she's in the same fucking room? Hey, keep it to yourself. You sound like a creep. It sounds like fun, but I don't think it's possible today. I don't think it's possible ever. Denied. Yeah, it's summer vacation. All the rooms must be occupied. Ugh. We can't do a sleepover? Poor Maybe Eddie. next time. Come on, you can all sleep over in my room. It's actually clean in this game. It's just a lot smaller. <laughs> hey, why don't we hit your place instead? No shit. I called it. Oh, but will your uncle get suspicious? Like... Why are you all celebrating? Because it's the start of summer and I'm top of the class and you never give me any spending money. Alright, let's do this. That's what you wanted to say, but you didn't have the courage to oh. actually say it. Uh no problem. Then it's settled. Nanako chan can join in too. Oh god. Alright, well at least if there's like seven of us, the alien has a couple more targets that you can go for instead of me. Oh yeah. If you're for all I know I've already been probed. Nanako-chan might be getting... No, she's not hungry. She hey, feeds herself. then why don't we make dinner together? Alright, you can kill your band. Wow, are you good at cooking, senpai? No. Well, sort of? <laughs> I think the most she can make is beef jerky. Wow, you can make beef jerky? No, I, I meant buy, buy beef jerky. I can, I can purchase it. I'm competent enough to what are you spend saying? money. <laughs> Did you already forget the tragedy of the school camp out? The tragedy already? How come I haven't been getting compensation for it? <clears throat> we already told you that was an accident. How many live playings are there? Can I get, can I get a part? Can I be the tree? She's right. The left we tree. Just a couple of the ingredients wrong. Couple. Guys, please don't do this. <clears throat> I'm begging you. I don't need another trauma to deal with. Hey, I'm a good cook too. Watch, you'll actually be a legitimate cook. I'll make something for you, Senpai. I mean, her mother is does run tofu shop. I mean, I guess so. Ta-da! 
Teddy has a great idea. I'm gonna leave. And he just <laughs> goes back in the television. Let's have a cooking battle. The winner will be crowned Iron Cook Inaba. I mean, every single chance I've gotten to be able to make food, I did pretty well. Mostly because I wish so, you know. <laughs> anyway. A cooking battle? Now I'm even more worried. Sure, that sounds like fun. <laughs> Your enthusiasm is dripping. Oh, but I'll win hands down. You sure you want to make it that easy? Damn, Marta. Dude, listen to me. For the sake of our stomachs, you have to cook something too. Oh, all right. Help us, partner. Help us, Ross old. Fowler. <laughs> Help. Oh, oh, I get it because it's Obi Wan Kenobi. Gotcha. Gotcha. Nice Star Wars. Then you can represent the guys team. Nanaka the one of very few times in this game to actually use your name and your full name at that, and it's just to make a fucking Star Wars joke. I can be a taster too. Teddy can be a tester too. All right, the judges are way too stacked in my favor. Kanji has the hots for me. Hey! Nanako wants me probed. Hey! That's true. And Teddy, uh, look at those eyes. No one could ever turn... He could never turn anyone down. At the end, you're <coughs> supposed to say that was delicious, right? Uh, yeah. Woohoo! I'm getting all fired up! Chie, get fired down, please. All right. Into the grocery section downstairs. Charge! Please don't tell me you're going to you go. Shit. Chie, you the best, but you're uh you kinda scare me sometimes. Oh jeez. Oh, Yo Nanako. Yeah, he said he's gonna be late today. I didn't know you knew how to use the phone. I thought aliens didn't know how to do that. Huh? <clears throat> dinner? You're all going to cook? Unfortunately. Ask Nanako chan what she wants for dinner. What do I want? Well, I want. Uh, anything's fine. Especially if it's Glorbagam. Yeah, she said she wants Glorbagam. Uh, I don't know what that is. Glorbal. What? Uh, dude, she said she wanted Glorbagam. I don't think it makes perfect sense. Yeah, what Kanji said. Dude, what the fuck is Glorbal Globble? Uh, I had it all the time back on the home planet. Kanji, I didn't know you were an alien. Yeah, I, I got over it. She's just being modest. Ask her again. Well, um, an omelet. Oh boy, can I write total destruction of the entire universe on it? I want to eat omelet with fried rice. There you go. And I'll bring the scalpel. What does she need the scalpel for? Don't ask. <coughs> Fried rice omelet. An excellent choice, Nanako-chan. With a dish that simple, I doubt we'll get a second helping of Mystery Food X. To slap his shoulder and be like, ketchup. He runs over to the ketchup aisle and like swipes all of it just to make sure they don't get it. We'll use mustard instead. Fuck! What's wrong? N nothing all right, let's go get our ingredients. Risa, I need your help here. Make sure you... Oh, they're all splitting up. Oh, no. Uh, if they're all making the same thing, why are they splitting up to different parts of the market? One goes correct. One goes north. The other is J. <laughs> Looks like you'll need all the help I can give you. I mean, you can go like that, too. Hey, what kind of omelet are you making? I'll go get the ingredients for you. What kind of omelet should you make? <clears throat> mm. I don't know. Uh, well, I'm not allowed to reset if I fuck up. <clears throat> Mediterranean style? I don't know. Herb filled sounds pretty tasty. I mean, that, that sounds pretty darn tasty. Everyone brought their basic ingredients to the cart. Foie gras? The fuck is that? Quite an eye you got there, senpai. It's a must-have for my special omelet. Okay, well, at least Risei sounds like she knows Don't what she's worry, talking about. I'll let you have a taste. 
Ooh, or maybe I could spoon feed you. <laughs> okay, we say. You walk on thin ice. I heard last time you choked down something so awful that words couldn't describe it. <coughs> it was horrible. You Don't get angry, it was! Who would do such a horrible thing? I fucking still have a concussion from when my head hit the table. Or the chair. Okay, son. This is going to be the only chance you get to gloat. Is that clear? No, she's going to get it another chance immediately after we taste her new omelette. I'm sorry, Jay. I'll crush you with one strike. Okay, I'd like to see you try. <laughs> you can call. I didn't think you were going to punch her. What? I said I was going to crush her with one strike. Whoa. You guys look like you're ready to enter the ultimate frying championship. Kanji looks like he's about to enter the ultimate awkwardness championship, and he's the winner. Kanji kun, that's alcohol. Uh, oh, it, <laughs> by the way, where's Teddy? That's oh, one of those supermarkets that has an alcohol allowance. Miss, am I allowed to eat this? Of course you can, dear. Eat as much as you like. Free samples, and you don't even have to be eighteen. Such a nice lady. Is this one cooked already? <laughs> This one's ready, too. Oh, dear. Oh, my. Are you hungry for more? Here, I'll open this one, too. You're so beautiful. Teddy, you fucking sneeze ball. Oh, my. No. No, I mustn't. I've got a husband and a son. He's 16, ma'am! But I really want this meat, and I want you to cook it, miss. Teddy. You need to stop right now. Oh, I couldn't possibly. The manager would get so upset. If you use the back room, ma'am, this is P5 all over again. I'm gonna knock the stuffing out of that bear. Was he hitting on? Wait, is that your mother? That would be so funny. <laughs> oh, this looks like a shit show. At least I'm missing. I'm, I'm mixing up pretty good. You say Chan was right. This celebration does make me feel like it's over. Don't worry. He doesn't have a butt to probe. He didn't grow that part yet. So Nanako can't do anything to Case him. Case really has come to an end. <sighs> His anal cavities are not complete. It's really Risa Chan. I really want to taste her blood. <laughs> I should go back over there soon. Are you going somewhere? Yep. The guys kept their promise. I'm going back to my home planet. Wow. I need to get going back home soon, too. The real world folks are wondering where I've been. You see, I'm actually kind of a reject alien. I was supposed to take over the entire world, but I got lazy. Also met a squid girl while I was over here, and she said they say exact same thing. We're we're best friends now, only because I'm mind controlling what her. But you, you know. What if you made a promise with me? Could you stay then? A promise with Nanachan? Um, a promise that you'll play with me. How about that? Yeah, Yo, what's the say? You can't just keep coming back and forth. You're gonna be stuck on one side all by yourself. Sensei, you kept your promise with me. Yep, now get the fuck out. So I should go back over there. Eh. Don't worry about it. <coughs> but a promise is a promise. It's not good to break them. Yeah, but the situation's changed. The situation has changed. You promised Nanako. Sensei. I've got the ears of a hawk. My promise with Nanachan. I made a promise to play with her. Do, do hawks have good hearing? I mean, I guess they have good sight. Can I really stay here? Well, actually, no, they do have good hearing, because, I don't know. Yeah, I guess, I guess they would have good hearing. It wasn't just my promise. Nana-chan made it with me. I'm really, really happy. Thank you. Thank you. Good. As long as she keeps trying to probe your non-existent anal cavities, we're okay. She might have to, like, start drilling, 
which is going to hurt, but it's okay. At least not, not any vital information will be lost. Recarm. Recarm. But no, not really. Yosuke, I have a new promise to keep. That's great. You also have a promise that you said you would eat Che's shit. <laughs> he just throws the ball on the table. Eat up! Oh. I very much wish I was back inside the television. Oh, I want to stay here a little longer. <coughs> Is that okay with you, sir? That's going to be difficult. Huh? What are you talking about? You're not going anywhere. You can't just quit your job like that. In any case, if you left. It's a wrap! Okay, at least she's happy about it. Whoa, ow. Bam! That's Risei for you. Bon appetit. I wonder which one is mine. The one that looks absolutely nothing like... It's a different fucking color. That's how you know it's quality. Risei is the heart one. Um, One of them looks incredibly plain. And the other just looks like mac and cheese with a little bit of ketchup on... That's probably fucking Yukiko's. Well, well wait a sec. Asking Nanako-chan to jump in and try these for us is kind of unethical. Yeah, asking a six-year-old to chow down is, uh, you know. Don't look at us like that! Don't oh. look at us! So it's our job to taste it first. Make sure we can keep it down. Well, at least this time I won't hit any hardwood flooring. I'll just slap into two buff dudes. Then try mine first, Yosuke Senpai. It's guaranteed delicious. Which one's yours? I assume it's the top left. You don't mind me going first? Actually, I've been looking forward to yours. I mean, Rizette cooked it herself. Can you imagine how many guys would kill me if they found out? This joke's setting itself up perfectly. She can't cook either, can well, she? Then, chow time. She can't cook either. That one's hers? <laughs> Oh no! It's the same. She's even worse. I I can't give this to Nanako-chan. Oh, it's so delicious that you won't let anyone else have a bite. It's so revolting that I'm depressed. How does every like the only good cook is Nanako, and she's a fucking alien and also six years old. You should try eating it too. It's. Spicy! That spiciness and heat are like lava in your mouth! You can't taste or feel the foie gras at all! It's starting to taste like iron! For some reason you sense a dull pain in your mouth as well. You can't give this to the alien. Her head will explode. They can't handle that level of spiciness. Here, try mine next. Oh no, it's just from bad to worse! I'll take this one. Kanji, I'm so... thank you. Kanji, that's a lot. Oh, she did a good job. She knows how to make an omelet. Oh, thank God. Hey, say something. Well, uh, how do I put this? It's an omelet. It tastes really, um, boneless. She put, like, nothing in it. What? That's not a word you use to describe taste. Specifically food that doesn't have bones. Does it taste good Unless it's, like, an Tell egg me. that's been fertilized. It doesn't seem to be dangerous, but you don't sense any flavor in particular. In fact, you don't taste anything at all. You can't even taste the... How'd she do that? How could this... How'd she do it? Not good. Uh, that's for sure. It tastes like... Like I'm eating plain oatmeal. I mean, it's an improvement. At least I'm not dead. It's pretty impressive that you put so many ingredients into a dish and it came out tasting like nothing. <laughs> <laughs> just isn't refined enough i think that actually tastes takes some level of skill i think it tastes good aliens can't have a high handle high levels of taste volume <sighs> nanako chan okay try my next ga please please uh... Know about this, but I think it'll taste good this time for sure. Okay, Chie. Maybe you didn't have what? Yukiko dragging you down. All right, Teddy, what do you got? 
Well? How is it? Wow! This tastes awful! <laughs> You say that. Ah, <laughs> uh -huh, I see. I see. It does it is. <laughs> it's so blunt. It's a huge improvement over the curry. <laughs> wow, this is awful. I concur. I'm third. Yeah. Thanks for the consolation. I feel so <coughs> much better. It's okay, Chie. I made fucking. What did I make again? I think this tastes good too. There's a little bit of a twinge in the voice there, alien. Nanako chan! It's okay. She's sitting next to the other alien from the other planet and a model, which we all know are aliens as well. Yeah, they're right. <laughs> You're totally right. It tastes awful. You can go, at least it actually tastes like something. Then try Rise Chan's. I bet you anything mine tastes better than hers. I mean, hers tastes like something. It's just so damn spicy, it's volatile. Oh no, what have we done? Oh, well, we got one. Sure enough. One strike. Well. Well, Yukiko and Chie's didn't taste good either. But at least theirs didn't cause any casualties. <laughs> <laughs> at least we didn't kill anybody. It's a taste too subtle for kids. It's a mature flavor. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you guys are just kids. I, I... I like spicy food. See what you did, because you didn't have a fine taste, you assholes. No, 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 don't, don't. Can she even say it this time? It, it's spicy, but it's still good. <laughs> She's trying so hard. Nanako-chan. <coughs> I knew it. Nanako-chan's the most mature person in this room. I mean, in alien years, he's about 87, so that's correct. Crocodile tears. Oh, yeah. She's an actor. Didn't you make one too, senpai? Uh, yeah, I did. You did? Oh. Yep, it's good too. Okay, I win. Get destroyed. <laughs> it seems you came out pretty well. She's doing it cheerfully. Nanako finished your omelet without letting anyone else try it. We're still starving. If you're so hungry, then help yourself to an awful tasting omelet. Huh. <clears throat> uh, I have a suggestion. Let's uh, wait for Dad to get home and yell at you us. You guys know about the festival they're holding in the shopping district, right? Why don't we all go? Oh, that sounds good. <coughs> oh, boy, we get to go out and get yelled at by Dad again. Great. Whoa. Does that mean the girls will be wearing yukata? Oh yeah, they'll get right on top of that, of this last minute suggestion. A festival? We'll bring Nanako-chan along too. Cool. I can come? Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, just don't, don't kill anyone. Sure. Really? Yay! <laughs> I'd like you where I can see you. That settles it then. In front festival of me. food always tastes great for some reason. Even if it ain't anything fancy. Because it's loaded with fat. Whew. We'll finally be able to get some edible food for once. We have three girls who can't cook. We promised the others you'd go to the festival in the shopping district. The couple has finally been caught. Rest is up to the police inquiry. Festival is on August 20th. You made sure not to forget this date. Oh, yeah, that'll really help cure our hunger. August fucking 20. What is that, like a month? That's like a month and 10 days? Eight? Oh no, that's just 19 days. Man, we already hit August. I didn't realize. <clears throat> Still 19 fucking days. 
Got a, got a bit of a wait on that one. All you can do now is wait for the police to make their move. Well, this is an awkward spot to end off the episode. I know it's only five minutes for this episode, but I'll probably uh, clip it in. That is going to do it for uh, this very quick session of Persona. I need to be going to work. Ugh, don't need to be rushing there. I just need to get going. So, when we come back next time for more Persona 4... We got a festival to do in 19 days, so until then, we just have to dick around and enjoy our summer. And before that festival, it'd be preferable if I could finish off Chie's social link. Although I have no idea where to find Chie if it's not if she's not at school. If 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 if, if it the thing is not at school, no, Nanako's the it. Chie Chie is definitely a she. Whatever. Have a good one, everybody. We got that fucking boss. <clears throat> Feels good, man. Me, Patra, for the win, Yukiko. For the win, your, uh, your fucking omelet tastes like shit. Actually, no, hers tasted like nothing. I just wanted to stretch that out to six minutes. Anyway. <laughs>